Unprecedented is a word we heard a lot back in March at the beginning of the pandemic. It's also the name of a new virtual gallery experience showcasing the work of Brock's visual art students. Visa gallery assistant Sarah Martin joins the source. Sarah, the theme of isolation takes center stage with this exhibit. Yes, absolutely. Um, I reached out to students at Brock University who are studying art under uh, online schooling now. And I wanted to ask them about the work that they've been creating over the past year under themes that kind of explore their identity and isolation during the time of the COVID pandemic. So I wanted to put this show together about their response to the pandemic because the, the way that art works is that art is always operating as a response to something, right? Art throughout life is a response to war, health crises, and now today a pandemic. So. I knew that these students continued making work, but without having the in-person element of schooling, um, I wanted to put together this show so that they could exhibit their work in the most public way possible without, of course, putting anyone's health at risk. This encompasses undergrads from first year to fourth year. What kind of things were you hearing about from them as far as their own isolation and the challenges of having to create their art at home without you know, I guess throwing things in front of some other like-minded creative students. You know, one of the biggest challenges is that lack of participation you get because one of the best elements of studying art is getting to be with like-minded people and getting to show your work with other people. So that was why a huge element of my own education was I love that element of getting to work with others I uh, began working at Brock and I was um, working in the gallery as a student monitor and I just loved the experiences of people showing their work, talking to others about their work. So I really wanted to give them the chance to do that even when, you know, you're in your first year of university, you're probably expecting to do a lot more than take two Zoom classes a week. So a lot of these students are really excited to get to kind of show their work to a broader audience. Although the gallery is closed, you've hung the work up at the Marilyn I. Walker School of the Fine Correct. and Performing Arts. When you stand there in front of the works, what feelings, what emotions come to mind for Sarah Martin? Well, I mean, to be quite honest with you, it feels very sad because my experience in that gallery, I would um, work for openings and stuff. So there's usually up to you know, 50, 60 people in that gallery with me looking at the work, you know, I want to I want to turn around to somebody and go, what do you think about that? What do you think about this? And doing that alone, putting that work up alone and experiencing the show all together alone, it is very isolating. And it reminded me of why all of these students sent me these works, because one thing I really noticed as a pattern in everyone's work was that they like to send they sent in self-portraits a lot. A lot of people sent me photos of themselves, which is really interesting because it's very reflective of the time. So yeah, I guess in, uh, in short, it just, it feels like a bummer, but I'm glad that they had this opportunity to um, have their work on the wall, so. <laughs> How can the public Something. see this work? I know you're doing a big Instagram campaign. I created an Instagram account for our gallery um, it just started with students submitting their work that they've been creating in class. And then I brought in the scope into, why don't we submit something to put a show together? And that's how it kind of came to be. But um, yes, so the Brock Visa Gallery on Instagram, and we'll be making a website soon through Brock University that will be um, images of the work and a 360 show of the work so that you can interact with it a lot more. Excellent. Thank you so much for joining us today, Sarah. It's uh, some great you. works. I've had a chance to check out some of them and you can really feel the emotion. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much.